Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do a special reading. Um, it is called, How Does He View Me? Now it's for my Gemini woman. Um, a lot of times I have women request readings and they just don't even know what to ask. They don't know what to ask in regards to their um, male counterpart or their counterpart. It could be same sex. So anyhow, um, I uh, was talking with one or two of my married male friends and I was asking what were the t the the determining factors or you know some factors that helped them figure out who they wanted to marry who you know why their wife is their wife so they came up with six we kind of streamlined it they had a lot uh, six questions that really narrowed it down uh, so this reading is going to tell you Gemini woman how your partner views you now this is general general energy of the collective gemini woman so if you want your own energy pool just go over to my website and you can find that reading and recorded readings video recorded readings um how does he view me so the first question is is he physically attracted to me yes some of you say well if he's talking to me and he's hanging with me yeah he is physically attracted no some people have um ulterior motives they you know it's getting cold outside soon they might need a place to live they need money whatever people play games so we want to know is is he attracted to my gemini uh, woman let's see seven of earth messenger of earth um oh wow okay so physically attracted I think that he is physically attracted to you still, but he also looks at a past you when he first met you, when he first gave you that offer of relationship. Um, you know, when he first met you, we all change. We we um, go through life's changes. He may be, yeah, he's reminiscent of when you were hot stuff. Um, and some of you still very well may be so you know that that does not pertain to you but if you know that maybe you can um, you've changed over the years for whatever reason then know that he's still attracted to that that girl that woman that he met um, initially so for some of you it's going to be yay and nay at the same time he still loves you still is physically attracted to you or, or and no he's attracted to the past you you know um, so all you gotta do is work on that I think this is the best spread because see women we love to live in our emotions in our head he needs to be checked to my soul and my body and all that stuff okay that's great but men are very visual if the visual changes then you know they, they don't know how to shift the energy and shift the emotions with it sometimes so take your part in that not saying that you have to be absolutely perfect for anyone because that's just not you know something that we can accomplish for anybody not even for ourselves uh, we'll die trying but um if you know you've changed that's for you if you haven't great 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 Okay, let's move right, move right along. The next question is, is he intellectually stimulated or attracted to me? So next two cards, we have Messenger of Fire, Page of Water. Sometimes he, so this is general energy. Gemini, uh, he feels like your energy is all over the place. You're a bit flighty. You're, you're passionate about this and passionate about that, but sometimes immature or unknowing or just outright ignorant to the subject of you fill in the blank he may feel like you know um, your intellectual capacity is um, a little immature for some of you you're quick and fast you, you're quick you, you know you're like rapid fire um, you help him or her whomever you're dealing with see things in a new or a different perspective or for some of you um, they, they view it as um, a bit of you know immaturity here intellectually okay let's move right along um, 
does he see me as someone who will get along with friends and family okay that's a big one for men uh let's see the three of fire and the two of air for some of you it's indecision for uh you know it's general energy for Gemini's partner um I'm hearing they have yet to see they have to make decision around um, even bringing you around the friends and family it's like oh wait and see wait and see for some of you it's like it's heavy for them because maybe you are different in some form or fashion from what they've dated or who they've dated in the past they don't know how friend and family will take to you some of them feel like you can be blinded to Oh, some of them feel like they don't know if this is going to be long term, so they don't even know if they want, like I said, introduction. They don't even know if they want to make the introduction right now. And it's still a wait and see. They're also evaluating you just alone right now. Be on your P's and Q's, uh, uh, Gemini. They're evaluating you to see, like, do I ever want to take this person home? Okay. Um, some of you just in that evaluation stage here. Okay. So the next question is, can he see himself marrying me? So can Gemini's uh, counterpart see him or herself marrying? Eight of fire in the reverse. None of these cards should be reversed. The world in reverse. The fool. Upright. Some of them feel like um, things would not move fast in regards to marriage and moving to the next level or the next step for them. Not It's not going to move quickly because um, they feel like the door is still open elsewhere, either for them or for you. And to fully embark or engage in marriage with you, with you Gemini, would be the ultimate leap of faith in a new direction, a new development in outright I'm okay all right I'm hearing outright foolish for them right now so the the answer would be not right now they don't see it moving forward it's stagnant there's some unfinished business either for the counterpart or for you Gemini and they feel like they can't take that leap of faith with you all right okay so the next question is does he feel like we are sexually compatible? All right. So Gemini, does Gemini's partner feel like they are sexually compatible? Four of fire, the six of earth in reverse. All right. So they feel like what they've created is instability or there is, or it's instability or it's not a give and take. Um, somebody's out for self when it's time to get down to business. Um, I got mine. I hope you got yours. Um, it feels harmonious at, at times, but it also feels like um, imbalance, a tug of war, a pull, a push and a pull, um, taking advantage of dominatrix mm, okay. um, sexual conquest uh, conquer so it feels like
think it's, it's there's an imbalance there for some reason. I don't know. I'm I'm getting um, domination. And it's, hey, some of y'all might be into that. That's what's up. Um, for a fire in the sixth of earth in reverse. Somebody's holding back on sex too. I mean, like. What? I heard somebody's, I'm good with not having it. Hmm. I don't even know. Get a personal reading. Domination, the tug of war, the imbalance, you know, the conquering of. Um, someone's also holding back sex from a relationship or they're holding back from going, from allowing themselves to be completely free in, in sexual conquest or whatever. Are you guys sexually compatible? I have to say no with the six of earth in reverse. You know, upright, that's... It's equilibrium. You know, maybe you guys just need to get back to, you know, knowing what makes the other person, you know, tick or feel good or whatever. I don't know. And, and then, you know, vice versa. Okay. So the next and the last question is, does he view me as financially responsible? Does he view Gemini as financially responsible? Fives, two fives, and this came out twice. Um, five of water, five of fire. Um, they feel like you need a lot of change in, in regards to finances. In, in the management or the mismanagement of um, a lot of hardships come to you because of indecision um, spreading your money thin uh, depending on uh, the kindness of strangers if you will um, knowing that someone will give to you or someone has been giving to you there needs to be a lot of change surrounding. You may have several suitors and you get money from all of them. That's how they feel. Or you have always been in that place where you just got stuff from men. Or Gemini, and this is general energy, you know. Lots of work to be done. I don't know. You know, and maybe this, for whomever is general energy I'm pulling in, maybe this is just not the person for you. You know, you don't have to go and change anything for anybody. Um, but if you feel like it resonated for you, if you feel like there's a disconnect with your partner or the person you're dating, and you feel like, hey, I think this is how this person is viewing me because of the way they treat me or the treatment of I don't know um, then now you know and you can request a personal reading also so that you know for sure and um, if you feel like you want to change something change it if you feel like you don't you don't have to um, the person also may be looking at someone comparing you to someone from their past in regards to physical attraction all right, Gemini, I hope that this message gave you a bit of insight. Um, do keep in mind, it's general energy. General, general, general. If it's not for you, it's not for you. Don't try to make it fit. Don't get upset in the comments. I'm not fat. I'm not stupid. Uh, whatever. I didn't say you were. Um, take care, guys. Bye.